dealing with the notorious Andersonville prison camp, a Civil War prison camp that was infamous because of the thousands of Union soldiers who died there. It's considered one of Homer's most important Civil War subjects. The woman stands at a crossroad suggesting that her fate, like that of the Union soldiers, is still undetermined. The gourds at her feet, used as water dippers in rural areas, were symbols for the North Star, used by runaway slaves to guide them to freedom. His single figures were studies in stillness, meditation and introspection, including portraits of many young women, almost always seen in profile or with their eyes averted. Generation, this looks like an interesting painting of an African-American woman. But in Homer's generation, this is an absolutely revolutionary painting. There are no other paintings like this. There are occasional pictures of black women as individual portraits or as maids, or they may appear on the edge of some wider painting. But he is putting this person front and center and drawing you into her experience. Winslow Homer 1836 to 1910 was an American landscape painter and printmaker, best known for his marine subjects. He is considered one of the foremost painters in 19th century America and a preeminent figure in American art.